may I tell you a story about an opossum? You know what? I'd love to hear it. <laughs> Did, Let me. Sure. Before you go. Uh huh. Before you are you go. pro, pro possum or anti possum? <laughs> I, I, I happen I, to think. I haven't thought about it till right this very second, <laughs> where I stand. <laughs> All right. I'm going to say that I am pro possum. Thank you. That's the correct answer. Look, they're, they're all they're they trying to do is shit. they're just trying to eat some garbage. That's all they're trying to How do. How bad? Yes. <laughs> they're not they're not stealing babies. No. They're not, they're not a no. dingo. No. They are not a dingo. Not remotely a dingo. They've had their name mispronounced for an eternity. That's right. That's right. Everyone thinks they're a rodent. No, marsupial. That's right. <laughs> People's almanac. <laughs> <laughs> People's almanac. Uh, and, uh, and when they're babies, they're awfully cute. They're very cute as babies. I mean, some, of the, some of the bloom is off the rose by the time they get <laughs> their adult. <laughs> smidge. Yeah. Just a smidge. I would like you to continue with your opossum story. I was not long in Los Angeles, California. I just moved there, and I did not know many people. Um, I was starting to know people, sure. and at the end of my street, um, mm -hmm. there was these uh, two guys from the comedy scene, these roommates who had these parties on top of uh, Jerry's Garage. This was, uh, maybe you were even at one of these parties. This is a long time ago, but it was uh, like Sunset, or Hollywood and Gower, um, something, somewhere around there. And so it was, I did not have a car, and so it was one of the few things I could just walk to. I knew there would be beer there. Sure. I had no money. And I was like, I could probably drink a beer or two, right? Nobody would get mad. And so I'm walking. It's nighttime. And the street is deserted. except It's me and another guy. This guy is like a few feet ahead of me. And I'm walking very briskly because i got to get to that free beer. <laughs> so I am walking. And, and before I can pass this guy... He, like, stops short because he thinks someone's, like, going to attack him or something. Yes. Paul was very threatening back then. Uh, if, oh, if you could have seen me walking around with my brass knuckles all over the place. Like a young, like a young tough. Yeah. Like a mean Brando. <laughs> <laughs> so this guy stops in his tracks and he turns around. And I said, excuse me. And he just, like, looked at me with pure hatred. And I kept walking. Then... A few moments later, he's doing it to me. Like, he, like, runs up behind me, and I turn around, and he goes, how do you like it? <laughs> and at that moment, I, I just sort of say, I said, I'm sorry, and I, I kept walking. And then this crazy noise happened, and an opossum was running <laughs> along this fence, like, inches from my head, and I jumped out of my skin, and the guy said... <laughs> You don't even know what that is, do you? That's a fucking possum! <laughs> and, I, and I kept walking, and he said, uh, you're all right, you're just like me, just a guy out here trying to find some pussy. <laughs> I wish the opossum would have said that. <laughs> oh, you know what? I didn't turn around. It might have been him. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, John Hamm! <laughs>